Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. The compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. This train is inbound from level 3 dormitories to sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond sector C, you will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound. No smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, the disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector 
FC test labs and control facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Good morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. Mr. Freeman, I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Most of the simulation results are perfectly acceptable, you know. Of course not. Hello. The sample was just delivered to the test chamber. Ah, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Do you think we should delay for another recalibration? Absolutely. Aren't you a bit worried about that exponential cascade scenario we discussed? Greetings. It's good to see you. I hope those can... Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Yet. Those containment parameters are still atmospheric contaminant sensors activated. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Defensive weapon selection system activated. Munition level monitoring. Hello there. Activated. Communications interface. We're right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Yes, this all looks nominal.
Mark. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedures today, Gordon. Yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that, although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely un- Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Ah, uh, yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Testing? Testing? <coughs> Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon, your suit should keep you comfortable. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. If you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Sí. 
training sequence. I've just been informed that the sample is ready for it. It should be coming up. 